Hello, my name is Ben Gormley. I'm on worship staff at New Life Church, and this is NLC Live. Okay, so the verse we're going to read today is Ephesians 1, 17. It says, I keep asking that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the glorious Father, may give you the spirit of wisdom and revelation so you may know him better. Um, I love this verse. I love that it's so it's an encouragement to continue to to keep asking that we can know God better. Um, so I think there's there's a, um, a an encouragement application to make, and there's also something new about God in this verse. The verse itself doesn't say something explicitly new about God, but what it does is it gives us a promise that if we keep asking God for His Spirit of Wisdom and Revelation, that that God will honor that and he'll let us know him better um I th- it makes me think about like you know with with meg my wife when we first got married i didn't know her very well but over the years as i spent more and more time with her asking her questions finding out about her I, you find out more about the one you love as you spend more time with them so i think as we spend time with god in his presence in worship as we're asking him about himself um God is God promises he's he's the source of all wisdom right I mean all wisdom comes from him he's going to give us more insight about himself about his his plans for us his plans for our family um so I think that there's our there's our application we spend time with the Lord and asking him for his wisdom and then and then we can know that he's going to show us something new one of the the things that's been so beneficial in my life has been connecting with God through imaginative prayer and simply that's just connecting with God through my imagination so imagining myself in the throne room of heaven worshiping God or imagining myself sitting next to the Lord Jesus and conversing with him, asking him any question I want to ask him and, and hearing his reply. Um, and so I just encourage you today, spend some time with the Lord. Maybe put yourself in a, in a place of peace, a, a place that's, that's comfortable for you and closing your eyes and connecting with the Lord, imagining Jesus there, asking yourself a question to him and, and hearing him tell you uh, a, a revelation, giving, giving you his spirit of wisdom and revelation so you may know him better and, and, and walk in the calling he has for you. So let's pray. God, we just thank you for your goodness to us. Thank you for your spirit that is alive inside of us. Holy Spirit, you lead us into all truth. I pray that you would lead each person that's listening to this, this, this devotional today into the truth you have for them. In Jesus' name, let's people said.